Hi, welcome back to Lifelong Learners. In this video today, we're going to talk about me going back to university. Now, it's been a while since I've done a video like this, you know, other than the podcast episodes that I've been releasing in the past couple of weeks. So I just wanted to do more of a natural video and talk about, you know, uh, hey, why am I going back to university? Because uh, actually it's been 10 years since I graduated from uh, university, got my bachelor's degree. Now I'm going back for my master's of education, my MED, which is really exciting because I love learning and I love teaching. Uh, so that is one of the biggest reasons why I'm going back. And you know, I when I graduated from my bachelor's degree, I thought I'm never gonna go back to university. I don't like you know, go in a university, although I, I do like certain aspects of it. But, you know, I see this as an opportunity, even though it's just a piece of paper. When you graduate from university, this piece of paper actually does have a whole lot of power, especially when you're working in the employment, you know, any sort of employee position, uh, the piece of paper has a whole lot of power. And also, you know, I do work with Bookmatic. And I believe that having an uh, MED, Master's of Education, will actually help a whole lot because there is a, a lot of credibility behind having that piece of paper. Having a Master's in Education and you work in an industry where you're trying to help people to learn better. Hey, yeah, I think it does help. So, um, but yeah, one, uh, one of the other reasons why I'm getting this Master's of Education is because uh, over here in Indonesia, where I've been working for the past 10 years, uh, some schools require you to have a master's. So an, a master's specifically in the field that you're teaching. So that's one of the biggest reasons why I'm getting it is so that I can still continue to work over here in this lovely country of Indonesia and uh, still get, you know, sponsored by the office and, and everything like that. So yeah, that's probably one of the biggest reasons. And I'm also excited to, you know, be able to get in the learning environment again. As you can see the books behind me and everything, of course, I learn every single day. Uh, that's something that I believe that all of us should do. So I'm used to reading a lot. I'm used to learning a lot. So being in the school environment, the university environment actually shouldn't be too much of a problem for me. The only thing I'm thinking about is maybe I have to work, right? I still have to teach until, you know, three or 4 p.m., seven to, you know, four. So that leaves me a few hours after work. And then uh, I also have my family too. Uh, and then I've also got Bookmatic as well. So I'm thinking, how am I going to be able to fit in, you know, this time for everything that I'm doing? So I'm going to have to prioritize. Um, but yeah, anyway, this is really random video and that's okay. Uh, sometimes it's good to just open up like this and just, you know, really be my natural self without having to like cut up the, the parts that I don't really want in, I'm just going to upload it without any sort of editing except for the intro and the outro. Uh, so hopefully for those of you still listening, still watching, uh, that you're getting a lot of it out of this video. And uh, if you are going back to university yourself, uh, leave a comment and tell me what you think about it and everything. Um, and, you know, of course, as a lifelong learner, as a person that runs Bookmatic, an influential social media profile and website, of course, I'm always looking for more opportunities to grow individually and grow as a business and uh, help people out, make money, and uh, yeah, just live a, a better and happier and more financially stable life. Uh, as we know, getting opportunities and meeting the right people open up huge doors of opportunity and success. So of course, I'm going to continue to produce content and videos and uh, 
Instagram posts and whatever. I'm still going to be here. I'm still going to be here readily available for you, uh, even though I may be more taken up uh, with time for university and, you know, new job and stuff like that. So anyway, my ranting is going on a little bit too long, I feel, but I hope it has offered value for you. And uh, I will, you know, maybe do a video here and there talking about my university experiences and uh, let me know if that's of interest to you. So talk to you soon. Take care and I'll see you in the next week's video.